What's up guys, this is Inside Tech, and I have a story for you that uh, you're going to find useful, okay? So, with Xfinity, Comcast, whatever you want to call them, you know, they're kind of a pain. And every couple years, it seems like your modem takes a crap and it slows down, you have to buy a new modem. <clears throat> so, and, well, anyway, make a long story short, we had this modem here, uh, Wi-Fi modem, um, it's SBG782AC, it's a decent, it's really nice. <clears throat> Um, router, cable modem, and one, okay? So anyway, it got slow. I was on tech support for a couple hours, and they say that I need to upgrade my modem, and I need to upgrade to the uh, 3.1 Doxus, which I was like, uh, well, okay, whatever, okay? And I'll get the speed that I need, okay? Because the speed on here was only uh, one megabit down. Then I went and got this guy, then I decided to get the uh, Netgear X10 just to have the highest speed possible so after connecting this new device new cable modem the sb200 which is not bad it's a little a little pricey for what it is um the speed was there then what happened um after i confirmed with xfinity that the 3.1 they were using uh it wasn't in the 3.1 mode so we had to spend another hour on the phone and the two lights on here we're only in a green mode, which means it's in 3.0 Doxus, not the actual 3.1, which will be in a blue. Uh, the two lights here will be blue, solid blue, okay? So I decided to, this morning, I had a, you know, premonition, a little dream to re take this modem off, put this modem back on, let's test it out. I put this modem back on literally half an hour ago, and I get in the same speeds out of this than it was this. So both of them are working on 3.0 and not 3.1. So you're asking me, what this, what the hell's, what the hell's going on? What's the point of this story? So what's going on is you're not gonna get 3.1 Doxus unless you're using their upgraded service, and they got they got to bring in like fiber optics into your home. So you're gonna have to pay a lot more money to use the 3.1. Okay. So anyway, to make a long story short. So this device and this device are doing the same exact thing. They both this one two hundred bucks. This one was two hundred bucks, um, and the speed now is the exact same three uh, same thing. This is um, almost a hundred megabits down. This one is almost a hundred megabits down. This one is pretty much um, like maybe twenty megabits up. This one is about eighteen twenty two megabits up. Um, whatever so don't waste your time don't waste your money um i don't know what the guy did the reset of the system i don't know what he had to change things around three or four different times and then we finally got the speeds because once i put this on the speeds were exactly the same as this in the beginning so when i upgraded this was actually um only like four megabits down so we had to spend an hour and a half on a phone to get this thing to work like it's supposed to so once we got rid of this, put this back on, now this is doing the same speed it's supposed to. So moral of the story, what the fuck? I mean, seriously, what the fuck? Comcast, Xfinity, whoever the fuck you are, what are you fucking retarded? As for the Nighthawk uh, X10, it's a beast. Would you uh, prefer to get this uh, over other modems? Um, I mean, you know, Wi-Fi routers? This thing is a monster. It can do everything you need. It's a beast. It, the only thing I would say is the uh, menu in there is just a little bit slow. Not the slowest I've seen, but it's a little bit slow. But uh, very re reliable and is a workhorse. It's a monster. But I uh, hope that helps you guys out. Enjoy. Thanks.